the two shelves at the bottom there, they've been done a couple of times. These ones the first time. And lots of cabinets got the first coat and the broom closet got, I hope it's almost last. Uh, once I got it all wet, I couldn't move it. Uh, I couldn't access the back to finish it. And I think I decided not to do the back on these. Uh, one thing that I kind of wish I had thunked about was accessing all of the sides. I think, um, I mean, I'm a noob, right? So I'm still learning lots. One of the things that I, sh I, I think I'll do in, in the future is, uh, I'll attack these things sort of from the top and then I'll turn them over. And again, sort of from the top because trying to spray upwards to get the underside of the shelves is, um, ridiculous so I won't uh, spend my time on that again I'm learning lots about the cleaning so what I, I I assumed that the lacquer thinner would thin out or basically destroy sort of like acid the polyurethane that seems not to be the case so the polyurethane is polluting the lacquer thinner more and more so it got to the point tonight where uh, the lacquer thinner was so polluted that I'm like it, it barely did anything to clean. So uh, first thing tomorrow, I'll be getting a new can of lacquer thinner, and I'll be dousing all of these pieces and parts and just leaving them in there for quite some time. And I think also I'm going to pick up some uh, gloves. My skin is starting to um, sting when I work with the lacquer thinner, so that's not a good sign. I'm sure this shit can't be good for me, so there's no sense in uh, exposing my skin to it in the future. Alright, nothing done tonight, and I'll see you another time.